welcome back to my channel. You are not going to believe some of the beautiful things that I found at the Dollar Tree. So many new spring and summer finds. I have actually never seen flip flops at the Dollar Tree like this before, so that was new to me. I wanted to get these um, ones right here with the pink catch me on them, but they didn't have them in my size. Here is another selection of 4th of July stuff that my other Dollar Tree didn't have because I was at a new one this day. And some more flip flops on this wall. Lots of stuff for like your summer cookouts. And I thought these glasses were just so adorable. They look class, but they're plastic. They just had so many cute dishes and cups and stuff for spring and summer. Now I apologize, some of my footage is a little sporadic because I was chasing toddlers around. And I usually don't do these types of videos when my toddlers are with me, but I couldn't help it on this day because you guys, look at this garden stuff. I was blown away. I could not believe that stuff was at the Dollar Tree. It looked so high-end and then I found these boxes and I didn't have any use for them So I didn't pick any up But my mind was just going crazy thinking of all the DIYs you could do with this And then there was a couple of ring jewelry trays that I thought were just so cute And again, none of this stuff looked like it came from the Dollar Tree and look at this missus tray Wasn't that so cute? I also found a lot of like more boho items like the fake succulents and then there were some cute kid items as well now you guys may have saw I got one of those elongated flower and garden tins but then I found these ones that are tall and narrow and then just a couple of really cute things here to grow your own succulents I was super tempted to get this one for my toddler because she's obsessed with turtles but honestly she has some dinosaur ones that are not being taken care of and then I thought these seashells were super cute and you guys look at all the stuff that they had for a luau so I do have clips in here from two different Dollar Trees so you may see some of the same things like on different aisles but oh my gosh I literally wanted to buy every single thing that I saw for Luau and both of my Dollar Tree had totally different things. They had some of the same items but one of my Dollar Tree had a lot more of like the elegant adult type Luau party stuff and then another one had a lot of like kitty type items and I just loved everything. Like I seriously wanted to buy all of this stuff. I saw a dude on a dime take some of these flowers and lay them in a row in the middle of the table like a runner and I was so tempted to buy some just to do that because it looked so cute. Cute, but I really didn't have any reason to do that so I just kind of had to um, keep going here so here is the second Dollar Tree by my house and you guys look at this stuff this seriously all had me so tempted to throw myself a birthday luau this year my birthday is in July and I'm just I just love luau's you guys I don't know what it is about all the decorations it's just my favorite. I've been to a few. I've thrown one before and I think I might have mentioned this in my other video where I was showing summer stuff but oh my gosh. I was literally obsessed you guys. It was so hard not to leave with everything on these aisles. <laughs> I just couldn't believe the quality of some of it. I actually had bought one of the banners for my daughter's birthday and when I opened it and unwrapped it, I was so impressed with the quality of it that I definitely will consider coming back here and getting some of these luau backdrops. I just assumed being from the Dollar Tree they would be really flimsy, but it was actually a lot thicker than I expected for a dollar. So now I'm reconsidering some of these photo backdrops if I ever do a luau. But all of the signs, the yard signs, the indoor signs, and everything were just so pretty. And I can just imagine how you could put some of these signs together just to make a larger sign. And I don't know. So obsessed. I almost bought this cup, but then I decided I have way too many cups already. But I did want to show you guys these. I thought these were so cute. Design your own mugs for like putting your own photo in there. And it has all the instructions on it. And like I said, my toddlers are going crazy, so I apologize that my footage is a little wild here. Look at all the ladies they had here. And then I was super mega impressed. They had these mini tiki torches. You guys, they actually sold the tiki torch fuel as well. I was so impressed, like if you cannot tell. And then I saw a lot more of the Wi-Fi signs. My other Dollar Tree only had one. This one had like five different ones. And I also thought that that little welcome sign would be so cute on a reef and then all the signs on this day were just all impressing me. I ended up finding some really nice glass items as well. Wouldn't these be so cute with the label on them? And I just wanted to remind you guys like don't sleep on the clear plastic stuff. 
that they have at the Dollar Tree for like parties. They have a lot of it out right now because of graduation season and it's actually pretty sturdy. And then I thought all of these little pieces were so cute and I could see putting like sand in the little starfish one and all these little geometrical shape things they had with the metal and the stone. I thought all of that was just so cool for a find at the Dollar Tree. So I have a Dollar Tree haul for you all and I'm super excited about it because I got some pretty good stuff. So my four year old's room is all pink and I actually grabbed these not realizing that they are actually a brand new type of basket and new find at the Dollar Tree. These were literally the only two that my Dollar Tree had left, but they do have different of these same woven basket looks, different colors and styles. This is all my Dollar Tree had, but I have since seen it in someone else's video after I picked these up. And they have smaller rectangular ones that are that are taller in height, but shorter in width, if that makes sense. And so these I'm really excited to use in her closet. I also got some more of these clear organizational containers for my um, some of my drawers in the kitchen, bathrooms, and closets. And I just realized the washing machine is really loud, so let me go close that door. All right, you guys, sorry about that. So the next thing that we have is some more of these organizational drawers. These have the pull-out drawers, and they're stackable. So I got four of those. I'm really excited to use these for either my jewelry in the closet and or some smaller items in the bathroom. And my four-year-old wanted this um, sprinkle nail polish. This is LA Colors. And so we got her that. I am seriously into all the Luau stuff that the Dollar Tree has this year. But I thought this is really cool balloon weight for a table at a Luau party. And I don't have a Luau party planned but I have done luau parties in the past, and so I'm adding to the collection that I already have. Um, and so I decided to get a couple of these items. I had originally grabbed quite a few of them, and I ended up putting them back because I do not have a luau party planned. <laughs> but for my 25th birthday many years ago, I actually did a luau party, and I saved a lot of the decorations from that party. And so every now and then I like to grab a couple of other things Somebody was racing down the street. I like to grab a couple of other Luau finds and then just use them for um, this great Luau party that I have in my head that I'm gonna have one day with the pig roast and the whole nine. We'll see, stay tuned if that ever happens. But I also got a couple of these fishnet decor. These are six foot by eight foot, so they seem like they would make a pretty big statement. I did grab two of them. These would be great for any under the sea, mermaid theme, pirate theme. These I feel like are so versatile for so many different things. That's why I grabbed those. And I got some of this uh, lip therapy from Vaseline. Now, I got this shower curtain because one of my amazing subscribers, I think it was Kathy, um, I mentioned her in one of my other videos because she's always giving me such helpful hints. But she had told me I have a lot of trouble getting the paint off my table, my girl's paint. And she said for her grandkids, she uses a clear shower curtain. So when I saw this in the Dollar Tree, that popped in my brain and I said, I have to get one of those so I can use this to lay out with my girls paint. This is gonna save me so much time and energy. So thank you for that, Kathy. Now I also got these shower curtain rings because there's a couple of little projects that I've seen some people do um, that I'm considering doing with these. So that's what those are for. I have already gone through my bottle of Lime Away. That just tells you guys how much I love it. So this is just a replacement for my Lime Away. And then I found some higher end um, glass items. So these I saw on Chic on the Cheap and I thought they were so beautiful. They're made to hold tea lights and they just have such a high end feel whenever you add the tea lights to them. I also just happened to come across these and I'm always looking for little trinket type pieces that I see other people have and I've never really had much luck with that. So I actually found two of these and I figured these would be great for like my living area. So I'm gonna start slowly collecting little pieces. I could just see this as like a, um, right, you know, like have a stack of books and have this sitting next to it or have this next to a plant. I could just see so many uses for these. So I did get a matching set. Now I saw these on Cheap on the Cheap as well. And I have actually never seen these in my Dollar Tree, but they were in the front glass section near all the plates and chargers. And they are these um, square containers, they're glass, but they have a clear plastic lid. 
and I could just see these with little clear labels on them in the pantry or the bathroom. I was thinking about these in the bathroom for cotton balls with, you know, just leave them clear and have what's in there. Or you could paint the tops white or black, give them a whole different look, silver, whatever your style is. But I could see putting like a clear label on here with white or black lettering. And I can just imagine so many uses for these. So I did pick up three of those. So my friend Brittany Rose actually shared that she got potting soil at the Dollar Tree and I didn't even know they sold that. So I had to pick me up some. Eight pounds for a dollar seems like a great, great deal. So my toddler was given this at church and so I was thinking we were going to plant it. But it's actually a little small thing where you germate the seed and then you move it to something bigger later. Um, but actually, I was looking at the Dollar Tree and this brand was at my Dollar Tree. So I'm thinking they got this at the Dollar Tree and it did say a dollar. So I thought that was kind of cool, like little uh, planting projects for kids. So I just wanted to show you guys that as well. I didn't purchase it at the Dollar Tree, but I think they may have. So here are a few other things that I got. It was some candies and chocolates that I sent my mom and my sister. I also picked up this little banner and candle for my two-year-old's birthday because it was that week. And here are some flowers that I sent my mom as well as some thank you notes I had grabbed. And then I sent my sister a card as well, which I couldn't get that open, so I just left it. But here are some bath bombs and this super cute summer cup. I ended up stuffing that with candy and the, putting the bath bombs and the card together. And I also got that lip gloss and sending that in a package to my sister with my gift to my mom. I had sent my mom some candles and stuff in addition to that. But they live together, so I just wanted to send my sister some stuff as well because she she has three little ones and she doesn't have a significant other so she was super surprised and happy to get that you guys have never checked out the chocolates at the Dollar Tree you definitely should they have some really nice name brand chocolates there so that is all for this Dollar Tree haul I got a little overboard and ended up putting some things back because I was going crazy there are some amazing things at the Dollar Tree right now and I feel like every year they get more and more high-end looking things and so I'm super excited to see what they come out with next and there were so many things I wanted to buy. I just didn't have a use for them, so I couldn't justify it. But I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. Subscribe if you're not already. And I'll catch you all in my next one. Bye.